Hello and welcome back. We are beginning the Elemental Towers today. I am so excited for this game mode. I hope it is as cool as the Dark Tower was. Let's check it out here. So this is the Academy Great Hall. Which keystone would you like to place? So we have two of them. They're, the other three towers are not ready. Let's go ahead and start out with here. Right there it is, it's inside. Did you hear that? I did. Let's go check it out. Let's go, Newt. We're running out. The lock is gone. Yes. This is great. Let's head upstairs. Alright, let's go. Master must be in one of the towers. Uh oh, I wonder where we'll be able to find him. This is the Astral Tower, but it looks like it's locked. Okay, so we won't be able to get into that one quite yet. Let's go check out the others. Alright, let's go. So we need to head up over here and check out these other towers. All right, so this is our uh, tower that we can get into, corresponding to Firefly Forest. So we will head on into this tower, and then we'll, we will be able to do the Ice Tower. Hopefully the Storm Tower is coming soon. There's been a re uh, information about it being released, uh, and hopefully we will, we will be able to get that. Let's go ahead and come on in here, though, now. Into the Earth Tower. Oh, this is really pretty. This is the Earth Tower. It's where wizards study Earth magic in their journey to become prodigies. Very cool. The Earth Warden, Florian, has his office here. Maybe that's where he is? Let's go take a peek. That'd be a pretty good guess. Hi, Florian. That would be. Florian! Thank goodness you're okay. Agree. Where are you? I'm trapped in my office thanks to the Puppet Master. I'd take a wild guess and say that the other Wardens are in a very similar situation. Oh no. Anyways, I'm gonna need your help. The door is locked and there's no way for me to get out of here. We'll help you, Florian. I'm guessing the Puppet Master hid the key somewhere. Do you have any ideas? If you ask me, it's probably on the 8th floor of this tower. That's the highest it goes. Well, let's hope you're right. You can count on us. Here, here, Newt. Then get to it. Don't leave me waiting here forever. You got it, Florian. Let's go take the elevator up. Okay, so now this is the common room here for the Earth Tower. Ooh, got some cool music going on now. Let's head on up. And we are going to be going up floor to by get floor. To floor eight, you have to go through all seven floors before it. Okay. Keep an eye out for monsters. I'm sure the place is flooded with them. I'm sure they are too. Good luck. Thank you. All right, plant, pet, star, bonus. Three times. Plant pets get three times the number of battle stars in the Earth Tower. Let's go. All right, let's go. So I want to switch to my plant uh, buddies now so that I can get this bonus. All right, so let's go ahead and head on around and walk through these doors. I believe we have to get into three battles for each level. Here is a sheet of paper, which is great. The Academy pages will be able to use inside of the Academy shop, which has a lot of really cool outfits and gear. So I'm excited for that. So I'm gonna be collecting these as we move through. And woohoo. And one of my main focuses now is going to be getting the gear from the shops and uh, trying to spend the time in the areas when I'm not filming. Oh, there, there was a door over there. So let's go check this door over at over here um in uh just getting the loot getting the gear all right here is a battle we can get into right here so let's make our way around this table 
Oh, haha, <laughs> we went through the door before the battle started. That was cool. Okay, now let's get in the battle. All right, so we are in sixth grade math right now. We are going to be doing exponents first. And so let's go ahead and start out with our embers. Um, this is five to the power. So uh, what exponents do is they show us how many times we are multiplying, which simplifies uh, the way multiplication looks like on a page. So this would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So the base is five. The exponent is eleven, which signifies it shows us that we're multiplying five eleven times. Okay, nice hit there for embers. And let's see what Scally does. Forest Hurricane hits for 24, 98 points of damage. Let's do our supernova here. Okay, eight to the power of five means we're multiplying eight five times. Not eight times five, but eight times eight times eight times eight times eight. Times eight. All right, up we go, down we come. And looks like one more AOE, so there'll probably be three more hits here, but that is okay. Scally is hitting us 2,500 points of damage. Nice hit there, buddy. Falling Star Smash. So our base is going to be 21. And it'd be 21 to the power of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 21 to the power of 7. Woohoo! All right, goodbye, Scally. And who is jumping up here? Okay, it is Aquister. Aquister is using Down Portal. Nice hit for all of us. It'll be weak against my plant types. And let's go ahead and do a mythical attack here and see if we can finish it up. We'll just go ahead and do Terra Blast. All right, so we are using the, the, the distributive property to write an equivalent expression. So distributive means we're going to dis distribute this 10 into this, which means we'll multiply 10 times x and 10 times 5g. So it would be 10x plus 50g. And that would be the distributive property. Ooh. All right, and that is a good hit. That should wrap it all up for us. Gave us a little bit of mana boost there as well. Nice work, nice work. Love that bonus. Woot woot. That's awesome. Okay, and we got five pages from there. Very cool. So we have one battle won. We need to get two more before we can open up the next door, which we have a trip chop right over here, so we'll be able to get into this battle. And here we go. All right. So this is the wizard battle. Looks like they are all plant. So let's go ahead and start out with, uh, let's do some hot snow. All right, so you have C pieces of candy to share among two friends. What expression shows the number of candies each friend will get? So they will get uh, C divided by two because you have C as the total amount and you have to share it, which means you have to make it into smaller groupings for two people. They'd be equal groupings, so it's divided by two. Here comes some hot snow. Nice hit there. Thank you, BF Mag Mayhem. I love your Blue Fury. All right, let's see what Trip Trap does here. We, we should have just enough uh, mana to go ahead and do one AOE, so that's good. All right, Supernova. And four to the power of two is four times four. Four times four is... 16. So 4 squared equals 16. Woohoo! Alright, up we go, and then down we're gonna come. And this should wrap it all up. Oh, not quite yet. Ooh! Alright. 
Sprike is bringing the turtle shell cactuses. 1773 points of damage there. And Falling Star Smash. So one, one tenth uh, to the power of three is going to be one one thousandth. Ten times ten times ten. Uh, 10 times 10 is 100, 100 times 10 is uh, 1,000. We do both the top and the bottom. Woohoo! So the top is 1 times 1 times 1, which equals to 1. All right, and that's enough to send Sprite scampering away. Awesome, five more pages here. I am going to have to use these towers to go ahead and level up my mythical epics when I get them. Oh, and there's a battle right there. Wow. That was exciting. Didn't have any time to react. Okay, hot snow. Here we go. So 4.8 to the power of 2. That's going to be 4.8. 4.8 4 times 4.8. And then that's going to equal to 2304. I'm using, since we're in sixth grade, I'm using a calculator to go ahead and uh, work out the math. And um, I expect that in class you probably are as well. Um, if you're not, then, you know, listen to your teacher, listen to your parents, listen to what they say. But uh, yeah, I will go ahead and use that. Working, working all of the problems out takes away from the the entertainment, although there is the education, so I try to balance the line between edutainments, and uh, so I feel like I just lose too much if I write everything out. So C minus 25 equals 11. C is going to be, so we subtract 25 over, which means that uh, we would, uh, to note, so while you subtract, remember two negatives equal a positive, so that would be plus 25 plus 25. So 25 plus 11 is going to be 36. And then we can double check 36 minus 25 does equal 11. Mm -hmm. So you can always plug in the value, double check your equation. When you start to do equations, that's really the easiest way to, you know, catch your errors. Ooh, looked like we had a, uh, I don't, the critical hit was on the wrong one. Okay. That is all right. We'll be able to build up our mana for the next floor as we continue onwards. Saplet misses. So let's go ahead and do a falling star smash here. Okay, does E equal one? Make the following equation two. Okay, so three times one would be three plus three would be six. Six equals 12. No, E does not equal one. That doesn't make this equation true. Woohoo! All right, and down we come onto Saplet. 41, 59 points of damage there. Goodbye, Saplet. And we won. Let's open this up. All right, I am enjoying getting these pages. Let's head back, okay? All right, we are going to head back to the elevator. Ooh. Not take a look at my stats. We're heading back to the elevator. And now we can just follow the hand. Right, we'll head on over to this way. And then we'll go down. I really like these rooms. This is a really fun environment. And then I don't think we went all the way over here, so let's just check for pages on our way back. There we go, a couple pages. Thank you, Newt, for letting us know. All right, thank you for letting us know. And let's come on over here. I'm really enjoying this music. Okay, and here we are back at our elevator. So we're gonna go ahead and take the elevator up and then we'll be ending the video and we'll do floor two in our next video so make sure you come back please go ahead and uh like and subscribe as we make our way up the earth tower moving from sixth grade probably into seventh grade before we are done so let's see if you leave without winning three battles you will have to start over again we won three battles so we can leave 
All right, how cool is that? And we ranked up a student achievement as well. Um, so we'll see you next time. Thank you for uh, checking this out and cannot wait to make it to floor number two. These elemental towers are awesome. Bye-bye.